Scientists in Kenya, Italy and Germany have for years been tirelessly working together to save the northern white rhino from extinction. But there have been obstacles, with the pandemic affecting one of the most important conservation projects in the world. And after several failed attempts to harvest a number of immature eggs known as oocytes, finally... There was a breakthrough in December. 14 eggs were harvested from Fatu, one of the last two remaining northern white rhinos on Earth. It was the highest number we ever got from a rhino and we were extremely happy about that outcome. And uh, on uh, Christmas Eve, two embryos were frozen so that we uh, really add another two embryos to our already existing three embryos. All five embryos are now stored in liquid nitrogen in a lab in Italy. The scientists are looking at ways to implant the embryos into a surrogate mother, a southern white rhino. After roaming in the wild for millions of years, the last remaining northern white male named Sudan died in 2018. Scientists saved his sperm and used it to fertilise the eggs of his granddaughter Fatu. But neither Fatu nor her mother Najin can carry a calf. And this is where a southern white rhino comes in. We already done uh, quite a few war, a little work with uh, using southern white embryos, which are uh, less precious than the northern white, as a tool to, to understand and to develop the, the procedures. So far, out of 12 transfers, we didn't get a pregnancy, uh, but we are understanding what are the problems. The challenges don't stop there. Experts say they don't have much time to save one of the largest land mammals on Earth. We have to produce a calf under the next two, three years. But right now we can't really work with the northern white rhino embryos because we haven't proven that we can produce a pregnancy. And therefore we're working with infertile southern white rhinos using this technology to helping them to have a calf and then get parallel the proof that the embryo transfer, the entire cascade is successful. One of the most endangered species in the world once roamed Central Africa in large numbers, but decades of poaching and destruction of their habitat led to their extinction in the wild. While the embryos raise hope, the process of saving the northern white rhinoceros still faces many challenges, including whether a calf born from this process would even survive. Sarah Khairat, Al Jazeera.